Play Store. Compre, venda e faça upgrade de skins com os melhores preços do Brasil. Venda suas skins e receba seu dinheiro de forma rápida e segura, com pagamento à vista para qualquer banco. Acesse agora playstore.com. Let's see if the smoke lands, this time towards CT. And Device hasn't hit the shot he did before. Dupree instead draws blood. Perfecto's MAC-10 is connected on the loose variable of Zipex. They're falling back. And they're pushing through B already. Magis gets some tons. Dupree's by the doors. He has to hit a no scope. The nade has done something but simple through the doors. And Electronic caught unawares. Knife out. Two versus three with 15 seconds left. They're charging Ooh. in towards B. Magisk, he's gonna get there in time, I think. No, already Flamey's found cover. And Simple, he could find this shot. It's so quick. Na'Vi have this round in the bag. It's a long and rather tumultuous road for Glaive to get towards those doors. He's got to get past Simple's crosshair, and he doesn't miss. He doesn't miss many, and that's gonna be three kills in the round for him. Device now will have to save the AWP. The last round wasn't as clean as they had liked. They did. And it's going to be device down. Now, AWP, the M4 in hand, a very difficult weapon to deal with this sort of scenario. Three players in front of him. Play will go down. Device will pull one back. He needs at least one more kill. And it's the big man waiting for him with the AWP. Device, he'll sit in the corner, allow them to get the bomb site here, hoping there's an overcommitment from one player. Yeah, and Zipex is there, hoping that they lean into his long angle. He can't get the trade. He's missing his shots. And Electronic's double could seal the round. That's a triple from Electronic, but Magisk does give us an ode to Kobe and 2v2. Simple does easily find the bottom of Magisk, and Dupree's just going to have to scarper, preserve the AWP. Na'Vi's T side is looking like a stranglehold on the Danes at this point. Yeah, it's electronic on his damage inflicted towards Flamey, but he's more than happy to take the jaw with the scope of the creek here. Zipex working his way through with Magus there. Will they go for the boost? Oh, got a dink in at least, but here we go, a chance. Oh. That's got the lead here, but it's simple. One versus one now, Dupree. He'll make his way towards the bomb site. 90% clutch rate on this map. We saw him win one against Liquid versus four. He's only got to find one and he's done it again. The percentage goes up again, Henry. 12-1 for Na'Vi, and simple just can't lose clutch. Squad, this is the weapon that has changed the tide of new T side, but Flamey, ridiculous! Oh! Ace, five kills, five seconds, and it's the fourth on the board for Na'Vi. Four players again, same approach. I assume Zipex on the other side of the map. Look at this, and it's going to be electronic. A nice adjustment this time. The HE grenade is going to do a boatload of damage here. Simple with a flashbang assist as well. It's a five <laughs> versus two. The are not slowing down at all, just adjusting their setup slightly there. Secret, they have allowed them to go through a few times. This time, Electronic deals with it in true style. Simple had a two flashbangs lined up, ready for his teammate Electronic, and he's on three. He could very well continue to find the last two as well, just Dupree and Zipex. They've got a frag each, but three that. That gives him a little bit of extra cover to be able to get out. Yeah, I don't think anyone's ever done it, but you can actually boost inside of that smoke to look over the boxes, and it's an incredible one-way uh, smoke. So, no one's ever really tried to do it. It could be interesting. Nice sniper away. That's some amazing accuracy. That's wonderful. Look at the master at work here. M4 tapping away. Quick quad kill. I'm going to say he would have had the last one too. Hunter and Nexer are inside of it, and Nexer especially. He's been so hard to take down on this bomb side. They don't have a lot of grenades or anything else, and they're just waiting for it right now. Smoke to block them off, and they're gonna try and see if they can come through. That's very ambitious. Molotov goes up and helping him out is Hunter. They didn't check the corner, and a big double spray coming through on the Kree. He turns 180 to take down Flusher, and I think they wanted to fly. CT spawn, no one's covering Banana. That's a must-win fight, and Nexa has it. Golden finding Kenny S, but now it's on. Three players coming up Banana. Yeah, and they have one flashbang there on Nexa and a defuse kit. Can they set it up nicely? Then that might be all they need. Oh. Running a shot from Jax Crims. A bit out in the open, a bit of an off angle, and Jax will continue taking down Crims as well, leaving Golden in a one versus four. He's already got the one kill, but he's going to have to try and ace them while stopping the defuse that's already coming through. Golden, and he's not going to be quick enough here, I think. That defuse is a second away, and Golden, he gets one more shot, but that was too much to handle. He'll try and Ooh. see, he'll get the ace at the end, but. That's two rounds now with guns where G2's been able to find some kills, at least trade some kills, and come out with at least a one-man advantage, just not able to convert it in the five-on-four. This round should be a freebie for Fnatic. Everyone is rotated and gambled towards the A-bomb site. Yeah, and you understand the, the way they were trying to sell that even. Yep. One smoke, one HE, but, you know, just hoping that Fnatic say, actually, let's not... 
Well, JW is going to have some attention. Chance to stat pad a little bit. He pre-fires hearing the footstep. There's a second. He holds the trigger, third and fourth. And he's going to back away. Does not want to lose. Does not want to have to rebuy. Reloading the AK-47. And it's Almanac. Is he going to give up the ace? I think surely JW is going to find it. And he does. All five for JW. Golden had an ace earlier in a... This could be big. Repeat. This is so good. I like that. We've seen it now with the op. We've seen it with the rifles a couple times from Kenny. He had that. He's had two fast flips. Play at the wrong time, and Jax gets a freebie. That's the mid-pressure cleared out, and that's going to probably prompt Fnatic to make some kind of a play. And again, we just mentioned the previous round. Golden has a lot of rounds where he's been able to sit at this B bomb site untested on his own. He's going to get tested, and he's going to get just steamrolled. He's smoking an MP9. Against I've... AKs and a Kriegs. It's not even clear how you would do that. The amount of things that would have to work out in your favor. Just don't even need one miracle. You just need a whole series need of five. them. five. Yeah. Well, he's got Flusher and JW there. Yeah, they've just rotated over now, but there's going to be another set execute coming in. There's going to be smoke. There's going to be Molotovs and those choke points. Here we go. The whole map is on this. Great counter flash, actually. And Golden, nice amount of damage. That's a good way to get started. The kill would have been better. Follow Avicii is decent enough, but can they actually win this? Oh, no! Through the smoke once again! He's got the knife out looking for someone planting inside, and Amanek, he doesn't know where Flusher is at the moment. He's down below. I can't believe he's... Go through this. I agree. I think they should have gone through that. You're, you're down a man. You've lost pretty much the entire rest of the map for all you know. They could be pushing up Ivy right now, so you don't have the time to go back and check it. Now, they are boosting back here, and... Yeah, even if they had stuck around next, they're not going to peek that. Smoke fades, and what a snipe from JW. A fight that he should not have been winning, but he did. And that brings it back in a 4 and 4 They might still be successful here. The Swedish team looking for a little bit of luck early on here in the half. Nexa, though, will take a double kill at the Famas. Turns it into a triple. That is outrageous. Thanks, Golden and Nexa. What a champion-level play. Does work out right in front of him, and he can just guess, and he's got it right. Taking down Golden. 40 seconds. They need to move. It, this has sort of already been found out. Jax is going to go down. Not even checking behind him. A gap in the defense. 35 seconds. Kenny being brought in now from CT spawn as Hunter gets a kill on Crimson. Hunter's alone. He's got no backup out here. Brolin and Flusher are looking for him. Amanek trying to cover it, but Hunter got no chance. Amanek, can he do a bit more? The first shot was through the smoke, but now he needs to get that flick and it's not going to happen. JW sneaking close. No scope. Of course he tries that. But the bomb goes down, and it's a three-on-three. Three. JW covering two people in this lineup. Good kill on one. He escapes death, tries to get it through the wall, and now Nexa inside of the smoke and see connector in a one versus three. I can't believe that Fnatic finished to force their way into this A yard. They had to fight every step of the way, and they're going to finish the round right there. Brolin with a nice triple. That is... Kenny S holding on to Epox desperately, and Almanac slides into position. He's got another holding on to this first train, swapping out for the Krieg as well. And it's hectic outside in the yard, but Fnatic coming out on top. The three final kills get them up to six. And it was desperate. It was a battle to They actually had the bomb site. Yeah, four and five. They had the double kill from Golden and then the retake in the following round. But then they kept going to it, and then it started working. So it's it's bold to call B hits that frequently. Omenek out mid. He's picked off. Yeah, just trying to run the gauntlet. Deep grenade. Actually lands a little bit too far behind them. But yeah, it's all on this round here. The Swedes, they need seven in a row. They can make no more mistakes. And G2 coming out through the smoke, trying to take a bit of a fight at Pop Dog. It's looking very disjointed right now for G2. They've been segmented out here in the yard and pinned down behind all the train carriages. Not looking good at the moment. And that's a flawless round out of Fnatic. While blind, Kenny came through the Molotov. That is a nice pick. That's one of the ops down. They can't recover it. It's deep into CT spawn. But this opens things up. And remember, Golden isn't playing this B bomb site. They might have thought that there'd be only one player here, and that's just not the case. JW blind, and it doesn't matter. No scope so fast. That's unbelievable. <laughs> and it just continues coming. Oh, smoke. oh no. How many does he have him in a round? They are looking to see if they can flash their way into a long fight. Actually, they just threw their flashbang, and no one peeked, so I'm not sure about that. They're all set up at the corner. Scout to put a single shot, but a lot of people up close. Can they get the timing down right? They've caught a lot of people with grenades in their hands. This time it's not going to be one of them. It is all rifles and jacks. He just doesn't even care. Dinks two people with the deagle and puts them to sleep. And now they're back around the corner. Flusher's on the other side with a bomb. Surely not Fnatic.
Well, Brolin's going to work his way up catwalk. They're all split at the moment. No one wants to make the play because they don't have a teammate nearby. Flusher can't really do anything because he just has a deagle. He's got to wait. Good shots from Jax. This should be the round where they just put an end to it, where G2 don't even have a say in it. Oh, down the middle! A third kill on JW. Can he get He doesn't have any more in him. Surely not. He's already done almost everything they need. Amanek with the UMP and now Brolin in a one versus three. And there's no point in running. There's only 30 seconds. Might as well just go for the straight up fight and hope that you could do it. He takes out Jax. And now, can he get the bomb plant? Kenny's on the one side there. I don't think he's even got much time here. Faking it will just buy more time. Yeah, he goes straight for it. And a little bit of a pre-fire there from Kenny. That Krieg, I don't know if it's enough to buy them this round. He's so low on health as well. And now Nexus gonna be showing up with that AK-47. If they knew how low he was, they'd just be using the pistols. They both come through. Oh, he does get it! No health, but the accuracy, 16 to 11.